Samai means ghost. But actually in Ghana, when you say Samai, it means that you pick a driver and you don't want to pay or you want to jump over the wall or swerve him maneuver your way just to swerve him not to pay. And that is the story that we came about. And so what inspired me is that one day I was chilling with my friend James Gardner and like his cousin. You know, James Gardner is an actor, he's a fantastic actor, he was part of the new actor that came with Fiona. He killed the Escobar role, but that is a subject for another day. Like I said, what inspired me was the fact that we were having a chit chat and talking about school days and his cousin narrated the story of him taking a taxi driver all the way from Cape Coast to Accra where he really had money to pay. And guess what? The reason he came was a prank. So it was an interesting story. I loved the whole adventure about it. And I was like, yo, I want to do this story. Summer is based on true events. The prank that he fell for was not about love. I wanted to tell something that people could relate to because definitely when you are in SS and your love affair comes, you know the way it is. No good feel, no thought of you, I shall run out of You know, so that was how the, the story came about. That's how I was inspired by Summer and I, and I did a writing and I did something. Here we are, yeah. I'm not even going to cast him because I was training those young actors and with such a story, it was easy for me to find who I wanted to play, what character, because I was training them already. Except the, the taxi driver by the son. He, he's an actor, he's Ivan, and then I contacted him. I felt that the role fit him so well and then he could deliver. And then I spoke to him and he said, well, I want to be on board. And that's how I became on board. Overall, the actors were fantastic. People are enjoying it sometimes, so they yeah, understood my vision, they yeah, understood what I wanted to put across, and then yeah, that's how it came about. The subject matter of the story was not just about love, I wanted a touch of more injustice. What? Hey, 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 watch it, watch it. You know, usually we hear, hey, do you know, hey, thief, 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 then everybody come out of their houses with their machete, with their carlasses, and we don't know what the story is, we don't know if indeed it's true that this person we're talking about is a thief. I have witnessed times that people have been killed by just naming them as thieves, right? when we have not even concluded. So this is a story of a young guy who comes from Cape Coast and then he comes to fall for a prank that his friend picked up on him and the consequences there are. One of the people I want to give shout outs to regarding this film is Jeffrey Norton. That dude is killer, you know? Uh, when I conceived the film, the idea of the film, I wanted to enter into the character's mind and I wanted the character to relate to the audience with a voice over. So I called him up and then I told him about the story and, and, and we collaborated and he came up with those beautiful dialogues that you're hearing the character say in his mind. The See, my days in school were times to break rules. I could make condoms float sea, chase girls for a living as if it was the soul's feed. One of such girls was Emifa, my biggest crush from sight. We shot someone in Cape Coast and Accra. We had to travel all the way to Cape Coast. I think we spent a day in Cape Coast and then we also shot like a few days in Accra. Some of the obstacles we had was the fact that it rained during the time we were shooting the Accra scene. So when we shoot for a few minutes, we had to stop because the rain was flowing. That was the only hindrance I can say that happened to us when we were shooting the summer. Summer is now showing on our YouTube platform, Ian Academy. Just go to YouTube, type Ian Academy. You're going to find all our content. We have interesting things there. My name is Eddie Nate, I'm an actor and filmmaker. See you on our next movie. And watch Summer. When I was a little boy, a friend's father told me a man's life begins at 40, but I didn't pay attention to age. Attention paid me to face a certain kind of lifestyle. Oh, shit. So you, how many times do you want to dream about this, your sight crashing an hour? Month or not? Yo, Mickey. Charlie, tell me something I want to hear. Chantel says she invites Emifa, the engineer. Make them can't spend the weekend for a year. Emifa. Brother Sam, I want to tell you go Accra. What chat time do you have? Uh, how, much? how 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 much? How